Hi guys, welcome back to Hair Aesthetic and welcome back to my Aesthetic Queens. Today you guys, I am back with another video and today you guys, this is going to be more of a tutorial and um, yeah, so I'm going to teach you guys uh, two ways how to braid like not too tight to where it's breaking the hair off, especially for fine hair. Because this is about, like, basically fine hair and braiding on fine hair. So, that's what we're going to do today. Don't mind my nails, you guys. They are shot, okay? So, <clears throat> so basically what I want to do is I want to teach you guys how to do box braids on fine hair. Which I'm only going to pretty much demonstrate one braid, but you guys get the gist of it i'm going to show you one in the front and i will show you one in the back and then i'm going to show you guys how to do a flat corn roll for the hair okay so with that being said like i said let's start in the front especially on these layered bangs because you want to control those frizzies if your hair is in layers and any type of sort okay so we're going to just you don't have to uh, part a box. I'm just parting a box out. You could do any type of uh, shape you want. I'm just doing a box. So, I'm going to part the hair. And depending on how big or how small you want it, then that's how you would do it. I'm doing it about a normal size, which you guys can see here. This is about a normal size braid, uh, which you would call, it's not small, it's not a micro, it's about a medium. So, now, I'm going to have to braid this backwards for you guys to understand, but just turn your hands around, basically, okay? And you want to take, I can braid like this, so it's not a problem, but you want to take one, two, and three, one, two, three strands, right? Oh. You want I'm gonna make sure it's even though. Okay. So you want three strands of hair, okay? And so what you want to do is you want to kind of bring your fingers up a little higher because you want these type of braids to look a little neater. So they're not going to be as loose, okay? So then you want to just start by taking it over just watch my fingers okay oh left a piece of hair out so it's not about where you're gripping it from it's about how tight you want it okay now mine isn't going to look as tight because of the angle i'm trying to break this at i should just lift that piece out let me go ahead and do that. So then, are these little hairs? Okay. So now, so even if it like kind of loosens up, just tighten it like you can always tighten it okay so you just want to braid it down even if you have a hard time you can slow it down so you can see how my fingers are moving in between each other okay well how the hair is moving okay so and these are what African Americans will call individual braids or box braids. But you'll be 
adding synthetic hair to it we don't normally just do our hair i mean if you have that type of length to get this then yeah you can do it with your natural hair it kind of looks better with the natural hair if you have this hair type so i'm not the type of person who i discriminate who gets braids who gets locks hair is hair it doesn't matter so you just yeah braid that down and it will look something like this but all over the head now i say because your hair is finer I would do a little larger than this because this is really small, especially for somebody who's getting like for a beginner type of hairstyle. It takes a while to take down, but if you have that type of time and that type of energy, feel free to do it as you like. But yeah, and as you guys can see for her bangs to be layered, it's not as many flyaways in this braid, okay? So now what I'm going to do is, actually, I'm not going to show you the back because it's harder for me to show you the back. So you guys get the gist. It's going to look just like this. But you can, there's plenty of sizes you can do. You can do a really jumbo. You can do four. You can do six. You can do eight. You can do 12. You can do 16. You can do 20. It doesn't matter. Whatever you feel comfortable wearing in your head. I don't let nobody tell you what you can and can't put in your hair, okay? Nobody. If you feel comfortable wearing it, wearing it. And I know I'm going to get a lot of backlash for that, but listen, this world, life is too short to be tripping over small stuff. It, it just is. Like, get over yourself. Like, it's just too small. I know a lot of people are going to disagree, but hey, to each his own. If you don't like that, fine. It's not what you like. It's about what I like. Or what they like. What they want to put in their hair. So, you don't have to look at it. Stay your house. Close your eyes. Okay, so now I'm going to show you guys how to do oh, what my lips is dry, honey. I live in Nevada. Like, my lips look like outside concrete so actually I'm gonna do it up here in the top that way you guys can see it a little bit better so what you want to do and I'm gonna I'm not gonna do a full like all the way down to the nape of the hair I'm just gonna do it pretty much like halfway that way you guys can see what's going on so I'm just parting some hair. This this is kind of like a big braid, so don't even worry about that. You can do it, like I said, however small you want it to look. So you guys, so I now know when I'm doing my giveaway, and it will be towards the end of this month. Even though we're like, we're really almost at the end of this month. But let me use this to tingle brush. So you guys can see that her hair is very uneven with the layers. So don't let that stop you or deter you from getting that braid, okay? That's not even gonna matter, okay? So, what you wanna do is you wanna go ahead and take this little bit of hair in the front right here. Hold on, y'all. Okay. So you're taking a little bit of hair from the front and you're putting it into three sections as well. Now, I know a lot of people like hair videos on this channel, but my channel is basically beginner hair tutorials. Like for people who are just learning how to do their hair, 
who don't know how to manage their hair or just want cute styles that anybody can do, even kids. So you want to just keep collecting little pieces of hair as you go back, okay? Your thumb should always grab a little piece of hair. As you go back, Kiasi, let me bend her head down a little frontward like that. So, you like I'm saying, just grab a little bit of hair at a time. If you guys can see my fingers, like I'm literally pinching hair as I go, as I braid back, just grabbing little pieces of hair. Don't mind the part. It's not perfect. I know. So. So just keep grabbing. Basically until you reach. Oh until you reach the back like so okay and yeah mine's could have been a little neater but this is just for demonstration purposes only because when i braid i would have the hair the head like this so i can actually see what i'm doing so if you're doing someone's hair don't have them lean forward like that have them lean back so that way you can see what you are doing to their scalp i hope that this was informative if you're new here subscribe to the channel and y'all already know to my old subscribers <laughs> i love y'all to the moon and back because without y'all i would not be here this far and i want to say yay we reached 800 subscribers and we are on a roll to 1,000. So make sure you guys are subscribing to the channel, liking every video that I post, and sharing these videos, and definitely having your notification bell on. That way you guys don't miss out on when I post and when I upload new content. And like I said, I am posting members-only content as well. So if you're not a member, you will not see the videos I'm posting. So don't think I'm not posting. You just can't see it because it's for members only. So if you want to check it out, like I said, it's raw and uncut exclusive, honey. It's not like how we are over here, okay? So make sure y'all check that out. Members only, okay? Members only. And it's, to me, I feel like you get what you pay for because it's better tutorials over there. It's more like in-depth tutorials, like really like, it feels like you're kind of one-on-one. So... Yeah, get your memberships as well. Like I said, with the membership, it comes uh, live uh, classes for members only. Like, you would only get the notification if you're a member to join that live. Um, also, um, for members only, we will be doing giveaways. And like I said, our giveaway will be uh, at the end of this month. Like, seriously, seriously. I've chosen a date that I want to do it. Um, and I will come back with the details soon. Probably, like, not this video. Not the next. Maybe the next or the one after that one. It'd be because it'd be closer to the date that I want to do it at. So, yeah. Then you guys are now. So, I do hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you watched to the end... Put hashtag giveaway in this video. Um, I am going to be uh, doing a name generator with all the people who has put hashtag giveaway. And yeah, so that's how you're going to be able to get it. And you must be subscribed. Uh, you have to comment. And yeah, you don't have to be a member. But for, for the $100 giveaway, I'm going to be doing... Uh, probably in February or March, I'm going to be doing a $100 giveaway. You have to be a member to get that. So make sure, I'm going to put the details probably in one of these videos. 
Um, or I'm going to do a, like a community post. So make sure you guys are checking out the community post. Um, but yeah, the $100 giveaway will for sure be for um, members only. So make sure you guys are getting your members. Like I told you, you guys are going to be getting the better deals, the better and exclusive content and a one-on-one -on -one lives and everything. So yeah, go ahead and check that out and make sure... Uh, you are subscribed and following and make sure you guys are following my other social media platforms that are linked in the bottom check out my wish list if you guys want to support this channel or my cash app um that helps keep these videos going and everything and what other you guys have done already i am truly blessed to have wonderful wonderful i don't know i'm not even gonna call you guys subscribers i don't know why i keep calling you guys subscribers you look you guys are literally like family like i see all the comments i see the love you guys are putting forward like you guys are a, more of you guys that i've seen and i talk to are becoming more like family to me so i do appreciate you guys and i appreciate the love that you guys give even though sometimes i i just don't text i'm a shy person i'm an introvert at heart uh, sometimes I just don't be knowing what to say all the time, but I will start commenting, but I always make sure I like, uh, you guys' comments as well, but I'm going to start more interacting with you guys as well. So, with that being said, bye guys.